Hey friends, it's Seth here. I've gotten a bunch of requests from people as to how I do some of the editing that I do on some of the photos that I take and I've told everybody it's an app called Snapseed but I've never actually walked people directly through how I do it so figured I'd take just about 60 seconds here to walk people through how I do it. I'm doing this video on my Nexus 10 tablet but it works exactly the same on my Android phone and I'm told it works the same on an iPhone as well so first take a good picture. I use my GoPro or my phone to take nice pictures and then go down select open photo. I'm going to take a photo from July 18th that I took inside our old Cutlass in front of a Ohio barn with my kids and I'll show you how to edit it. So if you click the little pencil button in the lower right it's going to bring up a bunch of options first one I usually select is Tune Image. Once you select Tune Image, you can scroll up and down of the different things you can do to the image. I like to turn my ambience all the way up. Uh, I like to turn up some contrast, maybe a little bit of saturation, too much. Uh, I turn the highlights all the way down and you watch the clouds, you can see the clouds start taking shape there a little bit. You can turn up the shadows a little bit if you'd like. You can mess with these features and see, what, see if you like them or not. If you click the button in the top right, you can see the before and after. So you can see all those changes that we made. There. Click the check, bar, check box in the bottom right. Next one I usually will do is go to Details, and on Details you can do Structure or Sharpening. I usually turn up the Structure a bit, click that top right, you can see what it does. Turn up the Sharpening a bit, and click the checkbox. See that makes a little bit crisper come down here to Drama, it's a filter, and Drama adds some cool filters to the sky, but it also turns your saturation way down. I like to keep my saturation up, so I usually just turn it right back up after it does that. You can see before and after what Drama does to it. And then let's say you want to just do one more thing, let's say we want to add a little bit of vignette adds a little bit of darken around the edges, click vignette, then you can move your vignette all over the place. So let's say we went right there, expand it a little bit, and then you can take some color around outside down a little bit, before and after, click the button, click save, it'll save it, and if you drag from the top, you can see your before and your after on the whole photo. Before, after. Before, after. So that's about 60 seconds of editing on Snapseed and uh, hope you enjoy it.